Northern Youth demands Buhari's resignation, says president has run out of ideas. Guys, we are going to get the details in a why, but before we do that, help us to subscribe if you've not done so. God bless you for being part of this channel. Let's get the details. The NYCN added that Nigeria was deeply soaked in blood lately turned into a different thing we are human we are roasted alive the news reads impacts a group of northern youth under the northern youth council of nigeria has stated that the president muhammad buhari in the, in nigeria stated that the following rising of insecurity challenges that engulfs nigeria will soon end and the youth are saying the best option for the president Mohammed Buhari is to humbly resign the, uh, the NYCN added that Nigeria was deeply soaked in blood and lately turned into a war zone we are human we are roasted alive for the crime of being in Nigeria or traveling on road that were constructed from the <laughs> from the taxes they pay to the government. Isha Abubakar, president of the NYCN, said in a statement on Friday. The statement reads: The Northern Youth Council of Nigeria called on President Mohamed Buhari to humbly resign, since it is obvious that he has run out of idea on how to subdue the terrorists that have taken over significant parts of Sokoto, Kastina, Kebi, Niger, Zamfara, and other states. And the basis of a Kaduna Abuja Expressway on one side, and recently, the daring move attack by Boko Haram stroke is work, which has continued unabated. It is embarrassing that President Mohamed Buhari is watching the terrorists eliminating regaining and reigning supreme and reigning supreme in our country imposing taxes on <laughs> and his supposed citizen stopping them yet he is unperturbed this is the clear characteristics of a leader that has run out of stem in the alternative we are he failed to eat the humble pie. We wish to call on the National Assembly to <laughs> expediently take actions and initiate process of impeachment against the president. Nigeria will certainly stand with them. This will equally help in redeeming the damaged reputation of the National Assembly. Ah. So you guys know that your National Assembly is being damaged. Their reputation is damaged. Ah! Where the above recommendation fails, Nigerians should do everything possible to defend themselves. We can't continue to watch anarchy reign supreme over us while we sit like cows or cowards to be killed. It is better you as arrested and kept in prison for daring to defend yourself than to be buried in a grave because you didn't dare to do something enough is enough wow nothing as saying enough is enough guys this is my first time of hearing it all so let us tell in our northern brethren good morning good afternoon Good evening to you all. Have you woken up? Oh, yeah. This guy has woken up. God bless you. Good morning. Anytime you woke up, now your morning. We pant your backs, eh? Thank you for waking up. Thank you for finally waking up. Guys, Northern Jude has really, really woken up again. They said once all this. When, how can we continue this? Do we continue in, in sin that grace will abound? It's not done anywhere. It is not done anywhere that 
you will continue in sin and ask grace to abound. No, 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 no. That's not possible. Guys, this is what this is. Honestly speaking, this is what it is. People need to rise up. People need to know that this government is not capable, not even capable enough. They are not 1% capable to take the matters of this country to the next level means giving it a solution, bringing a solution, pronouncing a solution. These people are not culpable for once. Since this thing started, Northern youth were caged by the politicians. Did you remember? They were asked not to join any, any protest when there was answers. Oh my God. They said they want to pursue their brother from the sea that they are born to rule. Now, I got one at the Uche. What are Hanin and Unquano dear? Gave her an air cam, gave her an air cam. Hana wash, we Hana Gapa. Yet, it's not teaching them any lesson. Honestly speaking, it's not teaching them any lesson. But let's see, really, if really they have woken up because I'm still doubting it. When their politicians will call them and give them money and continue the conquest they are doing, they will still go back. But anyway, we we'll have told them good money. Let's keep fingers across. If they have risen up, if they have risen up when others did, I don't think the whole situation will be like this. This thing I'm saying is the same thing that people are saying. Somebody is saying we are going to the comment right now, we are going to pick few. And we will call it a day as we are waiting for your own comments. Somebody is saying here, so their eyes have finally opened when it is too late. Chai, it could I could remember the way they criticize Jonathan like no tomorrow. Even carrying cascades from one area to another, saying they don't bury him. Another person is saying. Buari is a perfect definition of failure and disappointment. He must resign. Another person is saying Buari has no idea from onset since 2015. That's why Nigeria finally collapsed completely. Another person is saying, No, our northern brethren, you must manage you more. Sai Baba and no fear. And another person is saying, please wait. Wait for Lai Muhammad to respond to all, all you have said. Another person is saying, no, not yet. He must finish his good work in the north. Let's look for a new visionary expert to take over in 2023. You tolerated and fought for him since 2015. It's too late to lament wellers are not selling forms again. Guys, let's have your own opinion at the comment section. I will see you again in the next one. Bye for now.